we're processing some 308 brass on the Sassy Brass rifle case annealer. And we're getting them annealed. We've gone through and cleaned them all up. They're Lake City once fired brass. We've gotten them cleaned up and prepped and now our final stages is just to get that annealing done. So we are get ready to lo reload these. You'll notice that the case is being rotated as it's being annealed to make sure that we have a nice even annealing process all the way around the case. Using two torches to also en enhance that process. Currently using the, the uh, Sassy Brass unit in a standalone mode. We also have options to utilize case feeders commonly in the market, such as the Hornaday and the Dillon. Look for our other videos that will demonstrate that as well. Notice that we can adjust the torches up and down just by giving them a little bit of a twist there. And that alters the angle and the direction that the torch is hitting the case. So you can also move the holder, torch holder, up and down the leg to accommodate different lengths of cartridges. We have a speed control down here to increase the speed if you're running different size cases and you want to run, run them through a little faster or slower. So we can fully adjust that, fully adjust the temperatures, increasing the heat on the torches or decreasing it depending on what type of cases you're running. And then we can adjust the height as well just by giving it a little twist up or down depending on the cases. So, well, it works pretty well.